Hello everyone, this is question number 28. This question belongs to data structure from graph. So consider the graph below. Here is a graph is given in which four vertices is here. Let's label these vertices by 1, 2, 3, 4. And here 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 edges are there. So how many spanning trees can be found? So basically we have to find that total number of spanning trees we could make with the help of this given graph. So when we have the complete graph, the, uh, the formula of calculating the total number of spanning tree is different. But here, you, did you observe this graph that this graph is not a complete graph? So let's calculate that how we can find out that total number of spanning tree can be formed with the help of this graph. So we have to use the matrix formula to calculate the total number of spanning tree we could make with the help of this graph. So matrix formula is basically what first we need to make the agency matrix of this graph. Here in the x axis and y axis write the label of the uh, vertices name. Here I am writing 1, 2, 3 and 4. Likewise here, I'm writing the nodes name 1, 2, 3 and 4. Here in the diagonal, we will write the degree of each vertex. So degree of 1 in this graph is how many edges are connected with node 1? That is 2. So we will write here 2 in the diagonal. Just focus on the diagonal now. Now let's, what is the degree of vertex 2? Degree of vertex 2 is three because three edges is connected with this vertex now degree of three is degree of three is two here and degree of four is three here now again now calculate the edges between the vertices here between the one and two how many edges are there that is there is a path exists so i will write here minus one now is there a path between the one and three no there is no direct edge between 1 and 3 I will write here 0 is there any direct edge between 1 and 4 yes there is a direct edge between 1 and 4 I will write here minus 1 similarly between 1 and 2 there is a direct edge I will write here minus 1 between 2 and 3 here is a direct edge I will write minus 1 between 2 and 4 there is a direct edge I will write minus 1 here between 3 and 1 there is no direct edge between 3 and 1 I will write here 0 so between 3 and 2 there is a direct edge I will write here minus 1 between 3 and 4 there is a direct edge I will write minus 1 here between 1 and 4 yes there is a direct edge I will write here minus 1 and between 4 and 2 again there is direct edge I will write here minus 1 between 4 and 3 there is a direct edge I will write here minus 1 again so this is a matrix over here and we have to calculate the determinant of this matrix how we can calculate this just ignore the any one row and one column here and then we will find the determinant of this value let's ignore the first row and first column of this matrices for example here I will ignore this row and this column what matrices we got this is the matrix left with did you observe that i have right here the exactly same matrix and how we can calculate the determinant of this matrix the same values over here 3 minus 1 minus 1 3 minus 1 minus 1 minus 1 2 minus 1 minus 1 minus 1 and 3 so in order to get the exact value that how many spanning tree can be formed using this graph first create the agency matrix and then write down in the diagonal total number of degree of the every node and then find the determinant of this matrix after avoiding the any one row and one column so here the what is the determinant formula to calculate the determinant of this formula here is the formula written here we can use this formula in order to calculate the determinant so here we are using this formula and by putting this value here and calculate this value so after solving this we will get the value 8 so you have the formula you have the values just put this value in the formula and by solving this you will get the value 8 so the correct option of this question will be option number 4